Hello everyone, welcome to the Bug Expert channel. In this video, we will talk about solutions for friends who encounter the Call of Duty Warzone 2.0 game Steam ship error. It is not specified what exactly caused the game Steam ship problem that Call of Duty Warzone 2.0 players encountered. We can reach the solution of the problem by performing the basic suggestions to fix this error. Before we show you solutions, we will briefly talk about the forum. You can forward various errors you encounter to the community on the forum portal we have opened. For this, if your problem continues or if you encounter a different problem, you can get a quick response by sharing it on the forum portal. We care about your questions and suggestions. A Reddit user says that when he set the game priority to high, he did not encounter such an error and played the game without any problems. We can solve the problem by following this suggestion. To set the game priority to high, let's first create and open a new text document. Copy and paste the code from the article into the text document. Then let's perform the save process as I showed. After this process, let's say yes to the warning that comes by double-clicking on the file we saved and let's perform the registry operation. After the process is successful, you can check if the issue still persists. Warzone 2.0 game data is backed up to the Activision folder and read. If the files in the Activision folder are damaged, you may encounter various problems like this. For this, you can check if the problem persists by deleting the Activision folder. Let's write the file location that I showed on the start search screen and open it. Let's delete the Activision folder in the open folder and start the game and check if the problem persists. The fact that the application does not run with administrative privileges can cause us to encounter many problems with the game. For this, you can run the Steam application as an administrator and check if the problem persists. In order to do this, first of all, we need to close the Steam application completely with the help of the task manager. In order for us to perform this process, first run the Steam application and check if the problem persists by performing the verification process. To perform this process, first run the Steam application and you can verify the game file integrity by performing the operations I have shown in the video. There could be any third-party software blocking the Call of Duty Warzone 2.0 game. These are respectively, it can trigger the Ricochet Anti-Cheat program of Faceit Anti-Cheat, Riot Vanguard, Easy Anti-Cheat software to run. For this, if any of what we said is installed on your device, you can delete it and check if the problem persists. If you are playing the Call of Duty Warzone 2.0 game on the Steam platform, corrupt or damaged Steam library may cause us to encounter such a problem. For this, let's run the Steam application and click on the Steam option on the top left to reach the settings menu. In the new window that opens, select the Downloads option and click the Steam Library Folders button. On the screen that opens, select the disk where the Warzone 2 game is installed, click on the three dots and click on the Repair Folder option. After this procedure, you can check if the problem still persists. If your problem persists, you can try to move Warzone 2 to a different disk. For this, select the Warzone 2 game and click the Move button to perform the move. If a second disk is not visible, Click the plus button above to create a second Steam disk and perform the migration. After performing the migration, you can check if the issue persists. If your operating system is not up to date, you may encounter various errors like these. For this, check if your operating system is up to date. If your operating system is out of date, update it and check if the problem persists. Disable any antivirus program you are using or delete it completely from your computer. If you are using Windows Defender, disable it. For this, let's write virus and threat protection on the start search screen and open it. Click on the manage settings option on the screen that opens and scroll down the menu and click on the manage controlled folder access option. After this process, let's disable the controlled folder access option and come back. Let's turn off the real-time protection that comes up and go down again and click on the add or remove exclusions option. Click the add an exclusion option on the screen that opens, Select the folder and select the folders where the Steam application and Warzone 2 game are installed and save. If you don't know where the apps are, you can watch the video carefully.
After the save process is complete, you can run the game and check if the problem persists. If your problem persists, I suggest you to update your graphics card. For this, check if your graphics card is up to date. If there is a new update request, restart your computer by performing the update and check if the problem persists. If your problem continues after this process, we can eliminate the problem by disabling the in-game overlay feature. If you have an NVIDIA video card, run the GeForce Experience application, then open the settings menu and disable the in-game overlay option and check if the issue persists. If the problem persists, let's open the Steam application and access the library menu and right-click on the Warzone 2 game, reach the properties menu, disable the enable the Steam overlay while in-game option and check if the problem persists. If none of these processes is the solution for you, let's finally lower the game settings. First of all, let's open the game. Then go to the settings menu and click on the graphics option. After this process, watch the video carefully and update the graphics and display settings. After all the settings are completed, you can check whether the problem persists by entering any match. Yes, in this video we have provided information on how to fix the Warzone 2 game Steam ship error. If you are encountering various errors, you can reach the community with your questions by accessing the forum portal we have opened. By supporting us, we can expand our community. Thank you.